Hello and welcome! This video I dedicated to Chill Owl and exactly how to play on Frost. So, let's start it! Firstly, let's talk about build and skills, passives, so all combined together. What about Chill Owl? I'm using first Q, first W for PvE and third W for PvP. Favorite passive? Furious, and always only 4th passive, not 3rd, not 2nd, not 1st, only 4th. So what about Hunter Hood? 3rd skill, 1st passive. Don't use cleans against death givers, it's not worth it if they're playing with the 1st skill, it's just not worth it. What about cool Destroy? 3rd skill, 1st passive, it's fine, Guardian Boots, always 2nd always second skill. You can actually use any Plague Boots, so Royal, royal Boots, you know, Solar Boots, Guardian Boots, it doesn't matter. We're always playing with the 2nd skill. What about offhand? It's Miscolor always and Hume Crusade. Why not Martlek? Because we have actually troubles with the mana. So if you're gonna play on this build, you will see. And also what about potential build? You can use Soldier Helmet with a third skill and with the first passive. Against curse stuffs, you know, you can avoid damage from E from one hand curse stuff. Or if you're playing against Mirror, exactly against Chill Level, you can block Glacial Prison just by use block. What about Kulti Skull? That's the great potential for PvE because of uh, Inner Corruption. That's actually great skill uh, against bosses, you know, just for fast PvE. But at the same time, you can use second skill, fourth skill in PvE. So what to use, it's actually up to you. What about my personal opinion? I'm playing with a Hunter Hood and I really like it. So now, let's talk about consumables. It's actually kind of simple. I'm like, Healing potions and poison. I think you don't need explanation what to uh, what sunlight. Um, it's increased cast speed and cooldown rate. It's exactly like great food for chill level. It's really great food. Not eels, too, you know. Not other amulets with a cast speed and defense. No, just pork amulet. 7.3, 7.2, 7.1, what to use is actually up to you. What about potions? Healing potion always. Why not resist potion? Like, we kite build. And we don't need to use Resist Potion or Regenify Potion because we always just kite our enemies. Healing Potion, the best choice. And Poisons for PE, it's always. Now, let's talk a bit about build and what, like, how to play. So, Chill Level Miss Color 7.3 Omelette, that's the great potential to kite our enemies. We have a really high damage from our Qs, which have 1 second cooldown. And so great kite potential because of prison. We can use E skill, then just wait and give Q frostbite. That's the really nice combo, and with a high damage. So just because of blink, we can kite um, and make winnable situation just for us. Then after kite, after when we use E, when we use W, we can use cool destroy. And just because of amulet, just because of miss color, you know, we can use like super often, like 15 seconds, you know, uh, on cool disrupt it will be cooled down like 35 seconds, so this build super kiteable, and don't forget, you can die if you will forget about this. So I hope you got something new from this build, from this guy, and I hope you will like my fights, what I actually made for you, so let's enjoy. Take on the world! 
Yo, bro. Demonic Harbinger. Cheers. Cheers, bro. Cheers. Вспомним просто, посмотри. Раз, два, нажимаем. 